There are several reasons to set mathematics in a context. One is simply because if there is a real context and children are mathematizing their own lived worlds, they have a hook. They have a way in. They don't get lost in an abstraction. They can fall back on the real context. They may not even know how to start the problem, but they can start with a picture of the context. They find a way to model the problem, and then they begin to have insights of how they might go about solving it. They don't get lost in an abstraction and then think, what should I do here? Is this, do I multiply, divide, or add? It's about modeling the problem. So context is critical to help children realize what they are doing. But there's a second reason that's very, very important. And that is that when you design investigations for children to work on, you can actually, the designer can actually employ the use of context didactically. You craft it. You choose the numbers carefully. You want to make certain strategies begin to emerge. Let's say I want to make partial products emerge. And I line up, a, I get a picture of a bunch of um, six packs of water and they're stacked. And the only thing the child sees when he looks at the picture is the six bottles at the top. He can't see, he knows there's more packs, but he can't count the bottles because he can't see them. I've crafted that context to push him from counting all to skip counting or to use repeated addition. If I want to push partial products, I change the way I've stacked the water bottles, the packs, and I put some packs in front of others. Maybe I have, for example, four rows of five in each. And then behind it, I have um, four rows, five in each. Now I've pushed doubling the two partial products. Now, suppose I change the one in the back and I, where I have four fives and I add five fives and those are visible. So now there's nine in the back, but the four by five can't be counted. I've pushed partial products. There's all different ways to craft the context progressively as you build sequences of investigations where the child just feels like he's working on problems from his own lived world. And he's just doing math workshop like they do every day. But the investigations have been didactically crafted using context to consciously ensure progressive development.